Oxford vaccine says that there are positive uh, high-level results from an interim analysis of clinical trials of the vaccine candidate. The combined analysis showed an average efficacy of 70%. Uh, those are the details coming in. This is the Oxford vaccine trial in UK and Brazil, which shows up to a 70% uh, efficacy. Let me go across to Ayushman for more on this. Ayushman, take us through what uh, are the latest details you're picking up as far as the Oxford vaccine is concerned. The overall study, uh, which has given its interim analysis, uh, um, has said that the overall efficacy of this uh, vaccine ranges in 70%. This might look, uh, look disappointing as compared to Moderna and Pfizer, but it is very important to understand that the Oxford vaccine requires a normal temperature and that it can be uh, kept in the fridge as well. So... Uh, 70% as far as the numbers are concerned, anything above 50% can be granted the emergency use authorization by the FDA. So currently, if you see the preliminary analysis has come and it, in that it has been said that the vaccine has seen 70% of efficacy. It can be lower than Pfizer and Moderna, but it is very much realistic. And if in, it, uh, in the future, uh, the AstraZeneca is also considering to apply for the emergency use authorization.